Hey, what's up, you guys? Uh, this is going to be a, another N scale layout update, my second one. Um, it's been quite a while since my last one. Uh, just kind of been distracted recently with uh, hockey, school, and rail fanning. Uh, so, let's begin. Alright, so uh, nothing's really changed around the layout. I've uh, recently bought some new rolling stack material. So, this is my first piece of equipment. This is a Norfolk Southern SD70M number 2591. I bought this at Trainfest for around $70. Uh, they were selling it for 76 but I got the guy to give me a deal because I bought two other N-Scale cars from him as well. So uh, It's really detailed as you can see. Uh, the ditch lights do light up when the train moves but they do not flash. Um, I've tested this before and it's really good running, so um, can't wait to show some videos of that in action. So moving on to my uh, next set of equipment, uh, these are the two cars that I bought from the guy who sold me the Norfolk Southern for $70. Uh, as you can see, the uh, Chicago Northwestern grain car and a Union Pacific gondola car. Alright, so uh, moving on to my third purchase from Trainfest are these two Intermountain grain cars. Uh, one is a Canadian Pacific car and the other one is a Canadian National. Um, I'm going to have Shoal 4 uh, weather up the Canadian Pacific one uh, because he's also weathering up a ADX grain car. Um, he's also doing another cool project that I thank him for. Um, he's taking another P42 that I bought at Train Fest and he's making that into number 94 because when I originally bought it, it was unit 194. Um, so, look for these in upcoming videos of the layout. Alright, so uh, what you're looking at right now is what I believe a Jeep 38. Uh, I could be wrong, it could be a Jeep 38 2 right now. Uh, I believe that Canadian Pacific has rebuilt this engine in real life, but I will keep it a Jeep 38 just for the looks. Uh, this engine does have DCC in it, but it is so old that uh, I might make it a dummy unit because it's been sitting in an old abandoned layout for about 20 or 30 years. So uh, this is my next project. It's kind of old, but I'm still going to take the opportunity and fix it up. So, Alright, so moving on to the last set of rolling stock equipment are these two grain cars. Uh, one is a Sioux Line car that looks really cool and a Chicago Northwestern grain car. Um, I picked these up along with the Canadian Pacific Jeep 38 um, in the old abandoned layout so uh, they do have the old couplers on them so I will be replacing those and might be getting those weathered as well. Alright, so I hope you guys enjoy this video and expect more layout videos to come. Thanks for watching.